Hey guys, back again with another real versus fake video. On this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to spot a replica Ralph Lauren fleece hoodie. Let's go. So guys, before we get into the video, you may aware Ralph Lauren introduced their new digital authentication tags. Basically, they have added a unique QR code to the tag of their products, which will help the buyers to authenticate their Polo products by themselves. All you need to do is scanning the QR code on the product label. I have scanned the hoodie that I bought from Ralph Lauren website and it got authenticated within seconds. I mean, that was easy and quick. Also, you can see the fake hoodie doesn't come with a QR code. However, I don't think all their items come with the QR code yet. So if your Ralph Lauren fleece hoodie doesn't have a QR code, this video is for you. So guys, let's have a look at some other ways to spot a replica. First up, you can spot a replica by checking the material. It's a cotton blend medium weight fleece fabric hoodie which comes in 60% cotton and 40% polyester. High quality fleece fabric, very soft and comfortable on skin. Looks very durable, it is much lighter and warmer material than the fake. When you look at the fake hoodie, it is soft but doesn't feel that durable or not warmer like the genuine. It feels like very cheap quality fleece fabric. So guys, moving on to the next step. Check the small pony logo on the chest. The quality, the stitchings and the finishing touches on the fake hoodie is very poor. Also the spacing between the legs are different. I think it is not easy to copy this type of logo whereas the genuine logo has a more clarity to it and all the edges are sharp it has a quality finish compare the two polo mallets you will see the difference same time check the back of the chest logo as well you will spot the differences according to ralph lauren website they use 982 individual stitches to produce the small pony logo you can clearly see on the fake one they just tried to copy it but couldn't match its quality. Next up, moving back to the neck label. Compare the two labels. As you can see, they both look the same but color of the letterings, thickness of the letterings and the label color is different. On the fake one, letterings are thicker, bigger and more brighter than the genuine. Also the label itself more bluish than the genuine. But the genuine has an original navy Ralph Lauren color to it. Next up, check the construction of the kangaroo pockets. As you can see, the pockets seen on the fake hoodie are not straight. They are a bit longer than the genuine hoodie. It doesn't have a nice structure with comparing to the genuine. This is the left side pocket and you see what I meant right? Also, don't forget to check the waistband. As you can see, on the fake hoodie, waistband comes slightly taller and doesn't feel that durable. Feels a bit floppy with comparing to the genuine. Whereas the genuine hoodie is firm and sturdy, surely would last long. Another way of spotting a replica by checking the drawstrings. When you're looking at the two, on the fake hoodie drawstrings comes wider than the genuine. Also the color a bit lighter. But surely the genuine one feels more stronger and durable, even though it is small in size. Same time check the hood seam. Compare the two. As the fake hoodie drawstring is bigger, but doesn't have enough space in the hood seam. So it tends to gather as they got measurements wrong. However, you cannot see that on the genuine. Next up, check the care labels inside. As you can see, both hoodies got the same number of labels with instructions, but the label quality, print quality, the fonts and stitchings are different. They have used cheap labels on the fake hoodie to keep the cost down. Also, they have attached the supply code tag upside down. So guys, same time check the tags attached too. Same as the neck label, the tags doesn't have that navy color on the fake hoodie. More bluish. Whereas the genuine hoodie, you see that real navy color. Also, the genuine item always come with that white tags with details on. But you cannot see that white tag on the fake hoodie. Last up, you can spot a replica by checking the stitchings and the finishing touches. Like I always say, any genuine item would last long due to the quality of stitchings, cause they hold well and stay in shape. You can see the stitching imperfections on the fake hoodie, right? Not as genuine. 
They don't pay much attention to the finishing touches as they are time consuming and costly. So guys as always thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Hit that thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you are new around here. I'll see you next time.